self reproduce. Hello, how are you today? I hope you're doing fine. Are you ready to learn science stuff? Great! But before we start our lesson, I want you to prepare yourself as well as your materials necessary for your study. Try to find a nice and comfortable place inside your home where you can focus with your lesson. For this week's lesson, we're going to answer three questions. Number one, what is reproduction? Number two, what are the different kinds of reproduction and fertilization? And number three, how does the reproduction of butterflies, mosquito, frogs, dogs, and cats take place? What is reproduction? Study the illustrations below. Can you say something about it? So, based on the pictures that we have, Reproduction is a biological process by which new individual organisms are produced. How does reproduction take place? The illustrations above explain how reproduction takes place. What are the different kinds of reproduction and fertilization? Kinds of reproduction Sexual reproduction it occurs when sex cells, egg cell and sperm cell of two parent animals unite to form a new organism. The cell division will take place inside the female, most mammals, or outside in an egg, most other animals. Remember, the embryo is not identical to either parent. It will have a mix of characteristics from both parents. So here's the process. Sperm cell and egg cell unite. After a few days, it will turn into zygote, showing fertilization membrane. And then, cell division will take space until it will become a blastula that will implant in the uterus of a female animal. Example of animals that undergo sexual reproduction. Fish, mosquito, Butterfly, dog, cat, humans, cow, carabao, bird, and rat. A sexual reproduction. It is a kind of reproduction with the involvement of only one parent. Kinds of asexual reproduction. We have binary fission, budding, and fragmentation. Example of animals that undergo a sexual reproduction Hydra, sea anemone, Komodo dragon, starfish, and aphid Kinds of fertilization Internal fertilization It happens when the male releases sperm cells into the body of female animal to fertilize egg cell The embryo can either develop inside the female body until it is born alive or develop inside an egg laid by the female. The offspring of dog, cat, and humans are born alive while the offspring of bird and butterflies hatch from eggs. External Fertilization It occurs outside the bodies of the parent animals. The female releases eggs into the water or attaches them to a plant or rock. The male releases sperm cells over the eggs to fertilize them. Example of animals that undergo external fertilization are goldfish, frog, sea urchins, and salmon. How does the reproduction of butterflies, mosquitoes, frogs, dogs, and cats take place? For dogs, dog reproduce through the mating process where the male mounts the female during copulation. The dog's sperm cells will reach the eggs in the oviducts of the female dog. After a few days, fertilization takes place in the distal portion of the oviducts. The female experiences a 63 days of gestation period before giving birth to puppies. 
the female dog must be in the heat cycle for the mating process to become pregnant. For cats, female cat can be sexually mature in just 4 months of age. Once sexually mature, the female cat is ready for mating. The male cat inserts his penis through her vulva. Ovulation usually occurs within 20 to 50 hours after mating, and the eggs are capable of being fertilized for approximately one day. The eggs are fertilized in the oviduct and then make their way to the uterus. Cat's pregnancy usually lasts between 61 to 72 days until then they deliver their kittens. For frogs, frogs lay eggs. This process usually occurs through external fertilization where the female releases their eggs from her body into the water. Then, the male releases his sperm to fertilize them and develop into tadpoles. For mosquitoes, the male mosquitoes have claspers on their abdomen which they use to grab on female mosquito. The male's reproductive organ, the adegus, that extends into the female's vagina. Males transfer sperm and semen directly into the sac-like organ inside the female vagina. This organ acts as temporary holding site for sperm. After 45 seconds delay, sperm begin to travel from this organ up to narrow ducts into one to three spermatica. The spermatica are spherical capsules in which the, the sperm are stored long term. Sperm are maintained in this capsule for a female's entire life, nourished by glandular cell adjoining the spermatica. Finally, sperm travel back down the same ducts and fertilize eggs that pass down the common oviduct and out the vagina. Their larvae are aquatic and develop into pupa in 5 days. Adult female mosquitoes lay their eggs on the inner wet walls of containers with water. Mosquitoes generally lay 100 eggs at a time that turn into wrigglers. After mating, male mosquitoes die. I hope you learned a lot from our today's lesson. See you again in our next one. Bye!